so that at least take your time to read. The Care and Protection of Child and Parents Bill, which is set to be introduced in the Senate and sponsored by nominated Senator Elizabeth Ongoro, has attracted varied reactions with claims that the bill is seeking to legalize teen abortion. The sponsor of the bill, Senator Elizabeth Ongoro, however, says this report couldn't be farther from the truth. It's very sad that um, at this time and age, we can have a media that prints on... Um, nationally circulated papers, fallacies, mistruth, you know, uh, and, 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 and positions that are so ill-informed when all they have to do is take a copy of that bill, read, and then report what really is contained. All these things that are written here are so strange to me. This is a very good and well-intentioned bill. Ongoro says the issue of rising rates of teenage pregnancies is a reality in Kenya and though there exists the national school health policy which articulates a need for and the process of readmission into schools of teenage mothers, it has not been fully implemented. An act of parliament to provide a framework for the care and protection of child parents within the counties to provide a framework through which an expectant girl child mark the word child, for a child parent may actualize their right to basic education and at the same time ensure the care of their children. Ongoro says the bill seeks to provide a framework for the implementation of the right to education, including teenage parents. It imposes an obligation on the national and county governments to put mechanisms in place and establish programs that ensure that not only is the right realized in relation to teenage parents, but also ensure that the rising cases of teenage pregnancies and dropping out of school of teenage parents is curbed. As a Christian advocate for sex within a legal framework of what is recognized in our constitution as a marriage by two adults. That belief has not stopped me from coming across a 13-year-old child with another child on her back. When I see that kind of a situation, I can do two things. I can condemn her or I can do something that at least can stop the suffering of this child that, uh, that is carrying another child. The bill also advocates for the provision of care centers which would provide facilities for care of children born to child parents, among others. Caroline Kamar reporting for Channel One News.